Hey guys, welcome back to part two of our interview with Dr. Jawa here. If you missed part one, you can check it out right here. And because May is Arthritis Awareness Month, make sure to share this video and your photos with the hashtag CureArthritis for your chance to win a Cure Arthritis Action Pack. Now sit back and relax as Dr. Jawa here answers some of your questions. So what made you uh, want to pursue this type of research? Was there a personal connection? Well, I, um, a few years ago I was um, reading this uh, review paper on this topic of pregnancy and RA and uh, uh, my training is in genetics, uh, you know, I don't actually see patients myself mm -hmm. and it was really amazing to me at how um, this disease, this terrible disease for which there was no cure actually the symptoms could go away naturally during pregnancy and then come back later on. And so I started to uh, read more about this to try and find out what, what ha why this happens and realized that there's very, very little known. So to me, as since that was the same time when I was trying to find, uh, start my own research, uh, my own independent research, I thought this was a really good area to go into because there's so much to do. Yeah. Now, I, we actually uh, polled some of our Arthritis National Research Foundation followers who are a fan of Arthritis Now. And so um, I have two questions for you from them, if you wouldn't mind answering. I'd appreciate it. Um, you might have already touched on this one, but the first question is, will your project shed light on how new mothers with RA can avoid a flare-up right after the baby is born? What we want to find out basically is to understand what makes the disease go away during pregnancy but also what makes it come back um, after they give birth. Mm -hmm. And so if, as we hope we can understand that through this research, that will also uh, hopefully tell us how to avoid that uh, flare-up after childbirth. And so yes, we hope that this research can answer that question. Great. Um, and the second question we have um, is, is your ultimate goal to discover a way to mimic pregnancy to send RA patients who are not pregnant into remission? That's the ultimate goal, um, basically to use that as a model because, you know, people use a lot of animal models in various fields of research to try and figure out what's going on and how to find better treatment and uh, then they have to test that in humans to see how well the system that they created in animal models replicate to, before you can use that in humans but here we have a natural human model of the disease where the disease is changing naturally so yes we want to be able to mimic that and use it as a model to get better treatment um, we have seen you at our Meet the Scientists event before, and we recently saw you at the ACR event in San Diego a couple months ago. Um, why do you think it's important to keep in touch with the Arthritis National Research Foundation and kind of just, you know, be a presence? Well, I will always be very grateful to ANRF um, to have funded me twice. And so when you have these events, and especially they meet the scientist events, so I think it's important for the scientists to be there. <laughs> right. <laughs> and also, it's always a pleasure to stay in touch with all of you at ANRF. Uh, the other thing that's very important for me at these events is that I get a chance to meet with patients and their families also and tell them about their research. And it's, it's so nice to be able to talk to them and to see how interested and how important the research is to them and and that's very gratifying. And is there one thing that you love most about being a scientist? I know there's probably a lot to choose from but... It's uh, the hope that um, I can find something that will be useful to these patients and, and give them a better life. Thank you very much for sitting down with us. We look forward to seeing what is next on the horizon for you and your research. Thank you very much for having me. No problem. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check us out at curearthritis.org so you can find out how to take action to help cure arthritis.